Mama used to say, take your time, young man. Mama used to say, don't you rush to get home. Mama used to say, take your time, young man. Live your life. Live your life, oh. Y'all remember that? Take your time, young man. Don't you rush to get old. Mama used to say. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, family. Welcome to the Mental House with me, your host, Khadija. I want to share our article with you guys that I read. It's from out of the Daily Mail. And this, to me, is a direct reflection of who we are, where we are as a society. Um, it's amazing. Um you know, AOC was confronted, okay, by this guy that, you know, he makes his whole blog. I'm just seeing how crass and disrespectful people are. And in my opinion, I did a video about this long, 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 long time ago about our kids watching porn and being exposed to this kind of stuff. Where, which is going to make them to very extremely insensitive to sex in general. It's going to make them disrespectful about how they should treat women about sex. And it is something that is not going to get better. It's going to get worse unless we take it serious. I did a video about it. Nobody responded, or they responded like, you know, hey, come on, this is the new generation. Listen, it ain't no generation gap in how to treat people. It's not. Hey, Zeus, get over here. Come on. Get over here, Zeus. Excuse me, guys. It's not a generation gap. For respect. It's something that's timely. It's something that. Um, you should teach your children. Regardless of the generation. That they're in. Because. By you not teaching them that. It just opens it up to a negative situation. Okay. That's my belief. So I believe in going the respectful route. Uh, but at the same time, you know, knowing what to do if somebody just is not accepting your behavior and they want to push it, you know what to do. But your first response is to be peaceful with those who are peaceful with you. Okay? I've been taught that creed and I live by that creed. Now, Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez nearly attacked a right-wing troll who was sexually harassing her on the steps of the Capitol after he crowed that she was his favorite big booty Latina. Now, I see something wrong with that. A lot of y'all might not. And it goes to show you that we really can't have a government that nobody respects. We really can't have people sitting up there that call, rep, consider themselves representing the people and we treat them like we do prostitutes on the streets. Okay, he's cat calling her. I love you, AOC. You my favorite. You look beautiful in that dress. You know, I mean, it's just that the standard, the bar has been set so low now. I don't understand it, and I don't understand how. What is this limbo? How low can we go? I mean, so is there no respect for nothing? And this guy, you know, his name is Alex Stein, and I don't want to really talk about him too much because it just gives him more credibility when I think he's trash. It's trash. 
I mean, he, you know, he went on to say she wants to kill babies, but she's still beautiful. You know, the congresswoman was approaching the steps with an aide as police stood by during the exchange. So I guess this is what we call freedom of speech. Freedom of speech. Okay, until you get your ass beat. Until you get your ass beat. I'm done. Like what you hear, subscribe and share. See you in the next video.